हेलो एंड गुड डे एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई चैनल फिक्सिंग नॉलेज एंड टूडे वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट टॉप थर्टी क्वेश्चन एंड आंसर्स विथ एग्जाम्पल्स ऑन पाइथॉन लैंग्वेज सो लेट्स बिगिन वॉट इज पाइथन पाइथन इज अ हाई लेवल प्रोग्रामिंग लैंग्वेज नोन फॉर इट्स सिंप्लिसिटी एंड रीडेबिलिटी it supports multiple programming paradigms such as procedural object oriented and functional programming what are the key features of python python is dynamically typed interpreted and has automatic memory management it supports modules and packages making it highly extensible python also has a large standard library how do you comment in python comments in python start with the hash symbol and can span a single line or multiple lines using triple quotes let's have a look at the example shown on the screen what are python data types python supports various data types like integers floats strings list tuples dictionaries and sets Let's have a look at the example shown on the screen. How do you create a function in Python? Functions in Python are defined using the def keyword followed by the function name and parameters. Let's have a look at the example shown on the screen. What is a Python list and how do you access elements from it? A list is a collection of items that can store different data types elements in a list can be accessed using index you can refer the example shown on the screen what is a python dictionary a dictionary is a collection of key value pairs it is unordered and can store various data types as values you can refer the example shown on the screen how do you handle exceptions in python exceptions in python can be handled using try except else and finally blocks you can refer the example shown on the screen what is a python class and object in python a class is a blueprint for creating objects while an object is an instance of a class you can refer to the example shown on the screen how do you read input from the user in python input from the user can be read using the input function you can refer to the example shown on the screen what are python modules and packages modules are python files containing functions classes and variables packages are directories containing multiple modules you can refer the example shown on the screen how do you write a loop in python python supports for and while loops for iteration you can refer the example shown on the screen what is the difference between double equal sign and is in python the double equal operator checks for equality of values while the is operator checks for identity of the same objects you can refer the example shown on the screen how do you write a list comprehension in python list comprehensions provide a concise way to create a list you can refer the example shown on the screen what is a lambda function in python lambda functions are small anonymous functions defined using the lambda keyword you can refer the example shown on the screen how do you open and close a file in python files in python can be opened using the open function and closed using the close method you can refer the example shown on the screen what are python decorators decorators are functions that modify the behavior of another function they are prefixed with the at the rate symbol 
You can refer the example shown on the screen. How do you install external packages in Python? External packages can be installed using package managers like PIP. You can refer the example shown on the screen. What is a virtual environment in Python? Virtual environments allow you to create isolated environments for Python projects with their dependencies. You can refer the example shown on the screen. How do you use the map function in Python? The map function applies a given function to each item in an iterable. You can refer the example shown on the screen. How can you create a set in Python and perform set operations? Sets in Python are unordered collection of unique elements. You can create a set using curly braces or the set constructor. Set operations like union, intersection, difference and symmetric difference can be performed. You can refer the example shown on the screen. Explain the use of the global keyword in Python. The global keyword is used inside a function to declare a variable as global. It allows the function to modify the global variable. You can refer the example shown on the screen. What are iterators and generators in Python? Iterators are objects that allow iteration over sequences. Generators are a type of iterator that generates values lazily, yielding one item at a time. You can refer the example shown on the screen. How can you perform file handling using the with statement in Python? The with statement is used for automatic resource management. It ensures that files are properly closed after usage. You can refer the example shown on the screen. What is the use of the init method in Python classes? The init method is a special method in Python classes that is called when an instance of the class is created. It is used to initialize the object's attributes. You can refer the example shown on the screen. How do you inherit a class in Python? Inheritance allows a new class to inherit attributes and methods from an existing class. It is achieved by specifying the parent class in the subclass definition. You can refer the example shown on the screen. What is a module in Python and how do you create a custom module? A module is a file containing Python code. You can create a custom module by defining functions, classes and variables in a Python file. You can refer the show example shown on the screen. How can you handle multiple exceptions in a single except block in Python? You can handle multiple exceptions by specifying them inside a tuple in a single except block. You can refer the example shown on the screen. What is the purpose of the pass statement in Python? The pass statement in Python is a null operation that does nothing. It is used as a placeholder to prevent syntax errors. You can refer the example shown on the screen. How can you sort a list in Python? You can use the sort function to sort a list in place or the sorted function to return a new sorted list without modifying the original list. You can refer the example shown on the screen. Thank you for giving your time and learning with me on my channel, Fixing Knowledge. Stay tuned to see more learnings coming soon. And don't forget to like and subscribe my channel. Have a nice day ahead. Bye-bye.